Hello everyone, welcome again. Today we are going to make all bran, buttermilk and apple muffins. For today's recipe you will need the following utensils and ingredients. The grater, peeler, measuring equipment, mixing equipment, a muffin tray, nonstick spray, buttermilk, general flour, nutty wheat, sugar, all brand cereal, butter, boiling water, baking soda, salt, eggs and apples. The first step is to preheat your oven to 200 degrees Celsius. Now we're going to mix our all brand cereal, only one cup, with boiling water. And just set it aside so that your all brand flakes can absorb the water. Now we're going to take our sugar. Butter, and eggs. Then you're going to take your whisk and just mix everything together. Just mix everything until it's a nice batter. Make sure your butter is nicely mixed with all your ingredients. Butter is a bit cold, so that's why it's doing that. Now it's time for our apples. We need to peel them with our peeler very carefully. Watch out for your fingers, guys. Just very slowly. So this is a perfect recipe for good tummy health. It's got lots of fiber in it and lots of vitamins. So it's very good for you. Now we're going to take the grater and grate our apple into a bowl. Use the biggest hole for the grater. Again, careful for your fingers. We only want apple in our muffins. Okay. And now for the second one. It's better to use fresh apples. Then your apple is nice and firm. The reason why we're peeling the apples is so that the skin doesn't leave chunks in your muffins. Then your muffin is nice and soft and smooth. Careful when you grate your apple not to get your apple um, peel uh, your pips in your batter. The next step will be to take your grated apple, add them to your butter and eggs mixture. And then, this is amazi, but it's the same thing as buttermilk. So you can use 
any one of the two. Let's shake it a bit. So what buttermilk or mozi basically is, is sour milk. You can make your own buttermilk with normal milk and a little bit of um, lemon juice or vinegar. Then you, you got your own amas or buttermilk. So now you just mix everything together. So that's all your wet ingredients except for your oil bran that's been soaking up the water. It's now time for our dry ingredients. So we're going to start with the salt. Add your salt, your baking soda, your general flour. And now for the nutty weed. So nutty weed is basically general flour with added bran. You can make your own nutty weed by buying general flour and mixing it with bran. Just a little bit, mix this a little bit and then we're going to add our all bran flakes that's been soaking up the water. Now we're going to mix them into our egg and flour mixture. And now lastly, our dry all bran flakes. Remember we left a cup for later. Now we're just going to mix everything together. You can use your whisk or your wooden spoon. A wooden spoon normally works better. So I'm going to switch to my wooden spoon now. Just mix everything together. Remember, do not over mix. Because when you over mix, you will um, make your muffins be dense. So when you just mix everything until it's mixed, then your muffins will be nice and fluffy and soft. So there you go. Everything is mixed now. I'm using paper cups for my muffin tray, but if you don't use paper cups, make sure, sure to spray your muffin tray. Okay, so now for the best part. Scooping our batter into the muffin tray. Okay, so just take two tablespoons and not two full, three quarters full. Okay. There you go. I've filled up my one muffin tray now. So this recipe makes about 24 muffins. So it's ready to go into the oven now. I'm going to put the muffins now in my preheated oven for about 15 minutes. now time to take our muffins out of the oven. 15. It's been 15 minutes and they look delicious. So to know if it's ready or not, you take your finger very gently, just press and squeeze and see if it bounces back. Enjoy making your muffins guys. I'm going to enjoy eating my muffin now. Till next week. Bye bye.